We got this. Maybe. Okay. All right. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kita, aka Kita Palooza, and I am so glad that you're here today. Today we are doing something a little different. We're actually going to be doing some, what I would like to call questionable crafting. A friend of mine shared a reel with me because we were talking about dyeing things and buying clothes and you know, they may not be the same color that we want it to be or maybe we wish it came in a different color. So we took DIY, into our own hands and she was like, I'm gonna buy some Rit dye and I'm gonna dye this jumper that I bought. And I was like, sick, do you, super cool, right? But then she sent me a reel where somebody took the cushions of their AirPod Maxes. So if you have AirPod Maxes, or if you're familiar with the, um, with, the, with the Apple AirPods, these cushions, as you can clearly see, they're detachable and somebody took the light ones and dyed them another color that Apple does not sell. And I was like, it's not a, it's not a bad idea. It's not a bad idea. Amongst the inspiration to be like, okay, I'm going to take matters into my own hands. I was telling another really good friend of mine and I was like, hey, you're a designer, help me pick a color scheme. And then he was like, you know, if you, if you kept like the yellow that you were thinking about, you can make Kirby headphones. And I was like, what? And then the thought didn't leave my mind. I can make Kirby headphones. So that's what we're doing today, babes. We're making Kirby headphones. I'm, I'm pumped. First of all, I've tie dyed things before, but I've never done like an actual like, trying to make it look good dye job, if that makes sense. And not only do I wanna do a good job, I wanna I want to be proud of this. So yeah, it's questionable crafting, but like I want it to be like actually quality. So I'm gonna take you through everything that I've bought and then we're going to get this show on the road. If you like the idea of questionable crafting, scuffed beauty, if you like Sims and and home decor stuff and other things like that, please go ahead and hit subscribe. I'm really trying my hardest to do some really fun stuff on this channel and I can't wait to keep growing this community with y'all and to see what we create together. So follow along, I would love to have you here. And if this is your first time at the channel, welcome. Mwah. Thank you so much for checking me out. I hope you're doing so super well today. I've had these for a while. I bought replacement pieces to go in um, so that I can dye them, test it out. I did look up what these were made out of. And so to go with that, I did buy some Ritz Dye More Synthetic Dye. And then, of course, I'm not going to actually draw on my expensive headphones. So I did buy some clear cases for them to go right on top. And it's supposed to look exactly like, I know that there's like a nice matteness to this, but I wanna draw on it. And I know that there are some people that actually have done art on their maxes. I'm not that talented. Therefore, I don't wanna scuff it up. So I got these lovely little, and it's the first time I'm taking these out the box so we can see what it's made out of. So it's nice, it's pliable, it'll go on super easy onto the edges. So I will be drawing some little Kirby art on these. I got these cute little gems to put on and decorate as I see fit. And then of course, for the art itself, We've got some lovely Posca markers. The ones that are opened I already own, thankfully. And then I bought a white, a navy blue for Kirby's eyes and a little black outliner. Y'all, I've never used Rit dye before. So I'm excited. I'm excited and I'm nervous. I briefly looked at the instructions. And this is Editing Kita here to tell you that you always read the instructions for reasons that you will see very soon. I don't know what to tell y'all. 
honestly. We're just gonna do our best. So send some prayers, send some positive vibes. We're just gonna, we're just, we're just gonna go for it because that's what life's about. You're diving in. Um, so thank you so much for being here. Pray for me because they already said I need gloves and I don't have that. So I'm gonna use chopsticks. You'll see, you'll see. It's, it's, it'll, it'll make sense. So really quick, before dyeing, they say that you need to wash whatever you're dyeing in like a warm soapy water to make sure all the finishes and stuff are taken off. There's like a little bit of a coating and I'm not throwing these in the washing machine because I kind of just want to like do this and get it over with. I do have laundry that I need to do, but like to go through the whole washing process for just these two things. I'm just gonna break open a Tide Pod and wash it in the sink. Um, get it nice and scrubby with some nice warm water. And then we're just gonna dive right into it. So give me a second, I'm gonna do that. And then we're gonna get into the dyeing process. Woo! Uh, so there's nothing to show you here, y'all, because yeah, I followed some directions, but I didn't follow them probably as closely as I should have. I just kind of went with my heart here. And sometimes, babes, you don't always have to follow your heart. Sometimes your heart is the one that needs to do the following, like following the fucking directions online. And here you are shaking it, thinking you're getting all of it, thinking you're doing such a good job. And you're gonna come back and you're gonna watch this and you're gonna be like, what the actual fuck were you thinking? Yep, stir it up, baby. Stir it right on up. And then when you place those that aren't even ready, truly to go in there, yep, you're nervous. You should be nervous. You're gonna, pl oh my God, oh, I'm done. Yeah, shut up, girl. Mm -mm. <laughs> Because you're going to go through another week or two of pure frustration. That's right. Pour the rest of it in. Pour all that money into that boiling water. Oh, honey, I cannot wait for y'all to see what happens next. I'm going to keep it a buck with y'all. I've been standing here. I've been standing here mixing this. I think I'm going to let it soak for like a hot minute because this isn't coming out how I thought it would. I'm gonna show you. Uh. Okay, now that I've added more, more dye, it's starting to come out. You know what? It's going to, it's, it's going to be a surprise. How about that? It'll be a surprise. If you see it, you see it. If you don't, please know that this video is going to come out either way. And I'm going to say that I tried. Sometimes you just gotta chalk it up to the game. But I will show you that the chopsticks that I'm using to stir, they're coming out really pretty. So, something. Combination cooks on the stove. <laughs> We're just gonna, we're gonna do the part that I feel confident about, which is drawing on the clear cases, making it cute, making it look like Kirby. The sun needs to pick a lane.
one week later as you can see it's a new day welcome to my table of failure you know after letting these sit I gave I, I, I gave up I gave up okay I gave up didn't really come out the color I was hoping I was hoping for a deeper color what we're gonna do is we're gonna try again because mama didn't raise a quitter all right also to show progress on the headphones not the worst but we're gonna continue working on this side I don't know what route we're going with this because I'm editing as I go um, but Posca paint markers do work really well on the uh, on the the plastic outing cover that I got so I'm gonna walk you through what my plan is for round two of um, die job fuckery. Okay, so first off, shout out to Blick, my favorite art store. Um, I get everything that I need from Blick. And this is what I got. Another bottle of the Rit synthetic dye in yellow. We got another bottle of the Dye More Rit Synthetic in Apricot Orange. Not sure if we're gonna use this. Rit Color Stay Dye Fixative. And so I'm going to do literally what that woman in the Rit Instagram Reel did. I'm gonna take these bad boys. I have a glass jar that I do not use. I am currently boiling some water. We're going to mix these two together, most of this, a little drop of this to get the vibrant yellow that I want because I also discovered that this is a little too pale for what I'm going for. And then we're going to let it fucking sit. It is currently Friday afternoon. I don't plan on touching that thing until maybe tomorrow. Maybe. And we're going to let it dry and we're going to we're going to do we're going to do the thing. Pray for me that I actually get it right this time. We got this. Maybe. Okay. All right. All right. So now that we've had some practice and I consulted my bestie, Amber, we are going to go ahead and do take two. We're shaking up both bottles. And we're going to add a healthy amount of the yellow. And we're only going to add a capful of this orange just to get a little bit of that deeper tone that we're going for. Then I'm going to add the hot water to my mix already so I know that it's just the right amount. Um, I think we overdid it with the pot. And now I'm just going to go ahead and dunk those back in, swish them around a little bit, make sure they get nice and covered. And then we're going to start the drawing process. sweet angels so i realized <laughs> while editing this video that i didn't finish the video because i have just been so underwhelmed by the end result so <laughs> here is what they look like here's the end result of the headphones they're cute they're fine i just wanted to, to share i did not i used the originals I didn't, I didn't use the yellow. Um, I may retry. I may not. I probably won't. So I just wanted to show you what they looked like. And thank you for following this chaotic journey. I already have in mind the next craft that I'm going to make. So 
if you like um, questionable crafts with Kita, <laughs> let me know in the comments below. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for watching my videos. I hope you're all doing so super well. Subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Okay, bye!